This video ranks the top 10 best NBA summer additions. Number 10, Justin Holiday to Denver. 6'6", six 180 with a 7 foot wingspan, his best year was in 2019-20 where he held up an average of around 5 threes every game and made an NBA 20th best percentage. Defensively, he's versatile and sneaky strong. He'll be getting a ton of open looks next to Jokic and Murray, so expect him to capitalize and have a good year. Number 9, Seth Curry to Dallas. Curry's played next to Luka in the past, which included a 7-game series where he made 48% of his threes against LA. It'll be Curry's third tenure in Dallas, as Kyrie and Luka are getting a sniper they can kick it out to. Number 8, Lonnie Walker to Brooklyn. He gives the Nets a scoring punch, which they lacked after trading Kyrie and KD. Walker scored at least 12 points in games 3, 4, and 6 of the conference semis against Golden State. He bounced back from being out of the rotation, which proved he could have used more minutes in the first place. Number 7, Javon Carter to Chicago. Carter shot 42.1% from distance last year. He dropped a career high in points and dimes in the same game with 36 and 12. His 112.1 defensive rating was the second highest among ranked point guards. Chicago needed a point guard. Carter was a good pickup at the ideal asking price. At what point did you know you just had it and you had to keep going? When I woke up. Number 6, Dennis Schroeder to Toronto. The Raptors are getting a player who led the 2023 postseason in defensive rating. Schroeder played 16 playoff games and averaged 26.3 minutes. His defense, leadership, and playmaking gives Toronto a cheap, defensive-minded replacement for Van Vliet. Number 5, Gabe Vincent to Los Angeles. He averaged 15.8 points per night on 48.5% shooting from the field, 51.6% from deep, and 93.8% from the charity stripe in the conference finals against Boston. In Game 2 of the NBA Finals, Vincent posted a team-high 23 points. In the win, he was also a game-high plus 22, a huge pickup for the Lakers. Number 4, Marcus Smart to Memphis. Three-time All-Defensive Team player in 2022 DPOY Marcus Smart is someone that can steer the young Grizzlies in the right direction. Smart provides a major upgrade both floor spacing and defense-wise for a Memphis team that went down in Round 1 last spring. Number 3, Bruce Brown to Indiana. The reigning champion Nuggets will most definitely miss Brown. As a role player in Denver's title run, Bruce was 3rd in defensive rating, 10th in offensive rating, 10th in effective field goal percentage, 8th in true shooting percentage, and 5th in net rating. Number 2, Chris Dapps Porzingis to Boston. Porzingis was tied with Beal for the Wizards team lead in points per game last season. He finished third among all centers in points per game, only trailing Embiid and Jokic. He was the only center other than Embiid to be top 10 in both scoring and blocks per game at the position. It was a season in which Chris Dapps posted career highs in points, field goal, and three-point percentage. Number 1, Bradley Beal to Phoenix. The Suns traded for a three-time All-Star who's averaged over 30 points in three different years. If Beal can accept his role as third option next to KD and Booker, this gives him more energy to play defense. At one point throughout his career, the 30-year-old had an eight-year streak where he averaged over a steal per game. If Beal can get back to being elite defensively, Phoenix will be a top contender.